So the, the Aura Edition laptops uh, imagined with Intel was a collaboration about trying to increase uh, the user experience of the PC, um, trying to elevate the PC experience. Um, so we did a lot of research with uh, Intel support. Uh, it was about 10,000 users. We went out and said, what do you want, what do you want to see on your PC? Um, so we collaborated with that. We got a lot of uh, ideas. And we came up with uh, three in the end. Uh, one was uh, smart modes, uh, smart care, and then smart share. And so smart modes is about accessing PC, the features of the PC, and, and again, bringing those to the top um, so that it's really easy for, you, for users to use it. So it's a dedicated key on the, on the on the on the top row so you can just toggle that on and off very easily right okay. um, and you can see five features within that little widget the first one is shield and that what that does is it easily it turns on a vpn uh, and it also turns on some camera features that, that will see if somebody is looking over your shoulder and peeking at your uh, work and your content um, so if I turn that on, for example, it's going to bring up the uh, Windows VPN, but it could be Cisco VPN or whatever, right? Uh, you get to specify what sure. that is, right? Um, and then it will, if it detects somebody, it will bring up a little warning and it will blur your screen. Uh, attention is all about focusing on if you want to get something done for a certain period of time. Um, I don't know, maybe you need to get something done for the boss in the next 20 minutes right so you can turn that on and you got a timer you can set your timer um, but the other thing it will do is for example it will block so this was this website was on Facebook and it's blocked now and so um, you know I can't access Facebook I could put in Instagram I could put in YouTube I could put in any social media site and then it would stop it um, and then collaboration, that's all about uh, when I'm on a video call. So it's going to turn on background blur if I want, it's going to turn on uh, auto framing and it's going to turn on a low light enhancer if I'm in a low light environment. Okay. Um, and that, that's all based on AI. Um, and then the last one is, is wellness. And wellness is about eye health and is also about posture health. Um, so when it's on, it's going to tell you every 20 minutes to take a break for 20 seconds and look away at an object that is 20 feet or more away. So, you know, you, your muscles in your eyes change. And then if you start slouching, it'll tell you, it'll give you a warning and tell you to start uh, sitting up straight so you have better posture. All that is done using the camera and... Yes. Uh, is there any IR sensor also? Uh, I, not not an AI not an AI sensor. No, it's just a camera. Only the camera. And yeah. AI learning. Yes. Um, and then the last one is is we've exposed the uh, power features, power modes of the PC, so you can easily um, change them. So, for example, if I go on a trip on a long airplane ride, I can put it in eco mode, okay. and it'll extend my battery life maximum. Um, and if I'm going to work on a big spreadsheet, PowerPoint, or game, or something like that, I can then put it on power for best performance mode, so that I don't get any lagging or anything like that in the game, or, or you know, that sort of thing. And then when I get back to, to my normal, I can then put it back into balance mode. Okay. Okay. So that was smart modes. The other thing that came out of our research is people. A lot of people like to take photos and then edit them on their on their PC, right? right? So. We can take a picture. Uh, so let's take a picture of that, for example. There it is. Okay. Now I can easily transfer that to my PC. So I just tap it on the side and it brings it up. And then a couple of seconds later, you can see it there. And if I wanted to edit that in a, into a paint or something like that, I could just drag it into the app, okay. edit it, 
and then go into file manager and drag it back to the phone if I wanted to, you know, have it on my phone for later or something like that. And, and then the last one is smart care. And that's, that's, that's another app that's on the PC, which lets you curate your own support experience. You can self diagnose if you're that kind of person, we have a knowledge base, you can chat with an AI bot, uh, you can chat with a person, or you can actually have a video call with a person as well. And you can do that from the PC. And of course, if your PC is not working, you can also do that using um, we have a smart care app also on the on the phone as well. Okay. So that's all about the elevate again elevating the PC experience. Perfect. Thank you. All right.